Happy Friday everyone and welcome back. Still foggy in parts of the valley, the central Red River Valley, northwestern Minnesota, seeing most of that fog. Not quite as dense as we have been the last couple days in Fargo and we will see some improvements, but here's where we sit now. Visibility eight miles at the airport, 31 degrees, feels like 22. We have a little bit more of a breeze today out of the south southwest at 10 miles per hour. Moorhead, 28 degrees, 25 in Grand Forks. Visibility at the airport is four miles, but in town in the city proper visibility has been improving. Now temperatures for most areas are in the 20s to low 30s, not much of a difference from what we've seen from the last several days. Looking at satellite and radar, this is low cloud cover and fog with clearer conditions out to the west. Here's what we're seeing though for visibility. Half a mile in Thief River Falls and in Detroit Lakes because of the fog that just doesn't want to let go. Here in Fargo tonight, I do expect some improvements in our visibility. We could have still some patchy fog into tomorrow morning and the last few days temperatures have been steady within about three degrees. Now tonight temperatures will be falling into the 20s. Most areas teens in a few areas. So here's a look at your first alert forecast. The fog and a little bit of patchy freezing mist, freezing drizzle going to stick around linger in parts of northern Minnesota, west central Minnesota. Otherwise tonight, a little bit more clearing out to the west in eastern North Dakota. Cooler temperatures tomorrow morning as we just talked about upper teens to low 20s for most of us heading into our Saturday and then in the afternoon a little bit more sunshine from what we've seen the last few days. It won't stick around the entire weekend. We will have increasing cloud cover tomorrow night. A little bit more sun returns again for our Sunday, but here's what our temperatures are looking like. This is seven o'clock tomorrow morning. If you're not sleeping in for your Saturday, 18 in Langdon and Devils Lake, 18 Thief River, 23 Detroit Lakes, Bemidji and in Fergus Falls, 26 in Sisseton. Afternoon temperatures with the help of some sunshine and fog finally lifting low 30s across the area. A little bit warmer yet on Sunday, partly cloudy sky expected. Some spotty wintry mix, a little bit of drizzle possible on Monday. Temperatures warming into the 30s and 40s. Challenging records Wednesday, Thursday, Friday in those mid 40s. Next weekend still looking really nice with temperatures in the 40s, but records are in the 50s uh, just for what it's worth if you like to keep track. And we have a slight chance of some showers next weekend. Looking pretty few and far between though. It doesn't feel like end of January, early February. It feels like we're going into April. I was going to say, like yeah, it feels like April or maybe yeah. early November. Yeah, that'd be too. Yeah. All right, thanks, Summer. Still ahead at six. President Biden announced plans to provide some new broadband internet connections in Minnesota. There's also been some state investments that have added to that. We'll more on it in a couple minutes.